हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज़ रियाज खान एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल लेट्स स्टार्ट विद हडू इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैव कवर्ड द इंट्रोडक्शन पार्ट इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ बिग डेटा इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ हडूप हडूप इको सिस्टम्स यूज केसेस ऑफ हडूप ओके सो इन दिस वीडियो आई विल हेल्प यू टू इंस्टॉल हडूप For installing Hadoop, we require okay. For installing, we required a, a VMware. It is a workstation in which uh, we will download uh, uh, any of uh, distribution. The lot of distribution are there, like Cloudera, Hortonworks, Mapper. Big inside pie bottle. Uh, we will work work on cloud era only. Okay, so download of VMware is very simple. Just go to Google and type here download VMware Workstation 12. Okay. so i'm going to download from this file hippo.com let's go to this link and open a new tab okay you can see we have a registration pro 12.0 we press download free version Okay, so you can see here downloadation has been start. I have already downloaded, so I'm going to cancel it. After download the VMware, when we open, it's look like this. Okay, this is the home page. You can say it's a home page of VMware. Now VMware is done. now we have to install um cloudera vmware is a platform in which we will run cloudera okay cloudera quick start is the same method just go to google and uh, type here Cloudera quick start VM. Okay, just type this thing. Cloudera quick start VM. Now you can see the first link is of cloudera dot com. So just click on this. When you click on this. link it will take you to the official website of cloudera.com you can see okay you have to start from now get to start now select a platform you can see there are four platform described here listed here virtual box vmware kvm docker image we have already downloaded vmware okay so we'll select this and then get it now after clicking clicking on this get it now we will see this simple html form this we have to complete to continue okay okay so first uh, why are you downloading this vm there are some options are there to trial cloud in a platform for a production development for a college for an online training for self learning for testing okay uh, i recommend you just click on for self learning okay then okay i'll i'll fill the whole form so that we can continue business email you can give your personal id i'll give um, let's start with 
have to do at the rate gmail.com okay company you can give anything abc country will choose india india job role you can give big data job function analyst technical phone number you can give your phone number mm. okay so you can see okay just uh, simple it's a simple one just fill the fill form form and uh, click on continue okay now these are the terms and condition i'm sure you are not going to read all these points <laughs> so just click on i accept and submit now you can see download process has been started here okay so you just uh, it will take uh, some 30 40 minute so i'm going to cancel it i have already installed cloud era quick start for you so i will go to uh, my path where i have downloaded this okay okay this when you download it it will become in zip file so after unzip you will get this folder and in this folder these many files will exist okay so you need to do you, do, you don't need to do anything just install it and come to the vmware home page now here you can see there are four options create a new virtual machine open a virtual machine upgrade to vm workstation pro and help you have to use open virtual machine okay you have to use second option open a virtual machine okay now you just copy this mm, this path and paste it here after going to this path you can see one cloud era quick star vm 5.10.0 vmware is showing here okay just click on this and open now you can see okay you can see here cloud era quick start this is the home page this is a quick start now this is for starting your virtual machine and this is for edit you can edit your virtual machine by increasing and decreasing the ram okay for this virtual machine for this uh, uh, quick start via virtual machine you can set 4GB, 6GB, 8GB uh, I recommend you to use your uh, machine RAM as a 8GB if it's 4GB or 6GB it will be fine it, uh, it will be fine but you know your Cloudera your Hadoop ecosystem will work slow and if it's 8GB then it will work fast so here I am going to set 4GB only 4GB ok and now I will start by click on play virtual machine it will take uh, some time okay so it will open now now you can see 
now we are inside the VMware and Cloudera quick start okay so this is the desktop of Cloudera so just close this tab <coughs> Okay, so this is my computer, cloud in a home. This is the trash, recycle bin, Eclipse. So, all these came after downloading the cloud era quick start. Okay, <coughs> so you can see here one terminal is there. Just click on that. See, it looks like a um, you know. Linux cloud era. If I give a command name pwd, that is present working directory, you are inside home, then cloud era. Okay, so we will practice here. Uh, okay, so when you start working in any private sector, uh, you will not see this type of appearance. The company will provide you one username and password uh, with a host name so that you can use that host name into a putty and then after entering your password and your username you will connect from there only okay you're not going to see this type of appearance so for that i'll tell you how to install putty just come here in Google and just install putty okay it will take you to the official website of putty putty.org you can download putty here now after clicking here you can see there are a lot of putty are there so um putty.exe of 64 bit okay so you have to download this one putty.exe after clicking this you can see here the putty has been started okay now you can click on this I'm not going to run this because uh, I've already downloaded Putty. So I will come to my start button and search here. Putty. Uh, this is my Putty. Okay. So when you open after uh, running this Putty, you will see appearance like this. This is your Putty homepage. Okay. You can see button like load, save, delete here host name so this is the very important part so what will you give here in host name the IP address IP address of your cloud era just come to this terminal and type if config it will fetch working IP address okay this is the working IP address just open this and type it here 192.168.206.133 okay after typing the IP address give any session name I'm giving cloud error and uh, I want to change some appearance I will increase the font by 14 okay also I want to change color foreground cover I will give foreground is your uh, uh, text color so I'm giving it blue blue is my favorite one and background color background I am taking as a white okay now I'll come to session let's save here I'll see. Okay. 
session cloudera save load okay open you can see putty okay now here you can give a username you can see the username is cloudera Cloudera and the password has already been set as Cloudera. Both username and password is Cloudera only. This you have to note it down. Login as Cloudera. All are in a small letter and password also as Cloudera. Okay, now Control L. For clearing the screen, you have to press Control L. Now, if you type a command pwd, you'll see you are in Home Cloud Era. Check here pwd. See same you are in cloud era okay so in companies generally you are going to work in putty only okay let's close this if you want to start again just write putty cloud era and open oh i think i have opened IP address is not correct, I guess. I have config. Okay, 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 okay. Sometimes it happens. Actually, when whenever you saved any session, uh, if you now save in a proper manner, then it will give some error. Cloudera save open. Now oh, it will open. You can see hmm? cloud error cloud error. Okay, controller PWD. Now you can change your appearance from here also. Change setting. Go to appearance, change it to 14, 12, anything you, don't, you want to change. Colors, I'm changing to blue and background as white. Okay. Apply. Okay. Now your put has started. So this is all about. Um, um, Installation part VMware Cloud Era Quick Start, and then I have downloaded Putty. But these many things you have, you have to install you in your system so that we can start practicing. Okay, in my comments, in my description section, I have already given the link to install VMware Cloud Era and Putty in case of any issue, in case of any question you give a comment below in comment section so this is all about the installation part please like this video comment give your suggestion and don't forget to subscribe and also please click on ring ring icon so that in case I have loaded other video my next video you will get notification so till then goodbye